In the realm of video games, few characters have garnered as much admiration and iconic status as Cammy White from Street Fighter. I'm sorry, I just realized for the first time some people are probably understanding Cammy's last name to be White. Doesn't that piss you SJWs off? It should be Cammy Block. You know what I mean, according to you guys? More like Kamiqua, if, if we can go there. Despite fans and consumers rejoicing at the representation of a strong, confident, and proud femme fatale character, of course, Western, sad, ugly, ass blasted, just lonely, fat, you know, it was, ugh. Ugh, mother, mmm, whoa. Dudes looking like this are mad as hell at pretty women in games. Only the men should be thirsted after, not the ladies. That's how Western developers and, and designers and games journalists think. If I can't be beautiful, no one else can. Kyle has decided that it would be more informative to gauge public sentiment on this just doo-doo soaked opinion from from this this person, you know what I mean? This human from Earth. How harmful the beautiful Cammy's outfit was to them. Old outfit returning convinced me to buy the game, says someone with a bunch of likes. Damn. I wish your publication bankruptcy and closure. Never have you added anything of value to the discussion. Somebody else writes, I don't like Cammy's classic outfit either, but I do enjoy how nice her ass looks in it. Hope this bait. But if it's not, downvote. I don't think it is bait. Someone says Stacy Henley author is a five o'clock shadow in search of a man. Oh my God. <laughs> Thank you for underhandedly calling us all gross, unsightly, and saying depicting us as sexy is wrong when guys were literally s wear literally speedos in a fight. Thanks, sexist gaming site. We hate you too. God damn. You know, <laughs> it's TikTok teaching these kids. Holy shit. <laughs> I'm just saying said the site who is celebrating a nude mod for Leon Kennedy months ago. Yeah, man, it's all if it's okay only if it's men. That's equality, not if it's ladies, you know? Next week, why shirtless Ryu got us thirsty for his sweat. Prepare for standards and make it double, you know what I mean? God damn. Yeah, suck a dick. Wow, is this what people are, are responding to, y'all? Man, the costume has existed for three decades, and believe it or not, it isn't just men who enjoy it, but plenty of women, too. Beyond that, it's optional. Don't like it, don't use it, and move on. But let those who do like it enjoy it. As simple as that. Look at all the rational comments down here. Whenever people talk about gamers, they're all, Oh, they're making death threats, according to people like Lawrence Sontag, right? But the bottom line is, you're seeing civil, well-articulated, yeah, there's stuff like this, where they deserve to dunk on your stupid ass. Look, at it says, it says games journalists aren't people. <laughs> I, I was making that joke with the sarcasm going, this person, you know what I mean? Because it's, it's the type of assertion that a person makes that people immediately assume someone is just saying for attention. You must know it's stupid. You've made it this far in life to be able to breathe and, you know, you can get out of bed. You are, you are aware of your actions. You think therefore you are. You ergo, you something. You something, ergo, you know, vis-a-vis. -vis. You should be smarter than this, but if you're dumb enough to genuinely be harmed as a group of people, you're all dumb. If you're harmed by a beautiful woman, but naturally a hot man is totally fine. Yo, that's just sexism. 
Capcom and Japan devs actually gave you two choices and journalists still still complain. It's tiresome already. You know, Kotaku's already blacklisted and, and fans rejoice. We're all glad. Good. The gamer feels like it's in competition with nobody to become the new Kotaku. Why? Why you want to be the new Kotaku? If anybody from the gamer finds this video, I, it, you know, give each other all a sell a, get, get all of the ladies together in the office, stand in a circle and, and, and give you guys a good circle jerk and work the balls too, ladies. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> that's gotta be, that's gotta be your whole staff. And y'all putting out comedy for free? <laughs> I should, we should be thanking you. We should be thanking you. What are you doing? <laughs> this, this this outfit has got you fucked up. You wrote an article. I don't want to read any more of these comments. Boobs aren't scary. From, from oh man, I love it. Call me a killjoy, but I don't, I think that because this is not to my taste, that no one else should be able to enjoy it. This is what the. They, they're, they're so laser focused with their criticism of your ignorance that you must know is ignorance. We all, we all respect you enough to believe that there is a baseline for intelligence to where you must be above where you would need to be to stand behind the, the belief that Hot cami skin is bad. You're a fool. And worse, this impression of a woman that you're doing is offensive. Allow me to read the end of your article. Perhaps I shouldn't care so much about an optional additional costume. You're, you're aware of that. You acknowledge that. You go on. But the thing is, I don't care so much. Let me scroll up so you can see the article that this nigga wrote and then put on their Twitter. Please go look at my thing. It's not a dumb opinion. It's not rage bait. I don't care at the end of my article. I just think that's very style bad. Clearly. I'm not going to lose any sleep over it. <laughs> you, you, want me, you want me to scroll up on the article again? What do you mean? <laughs> If anything, that's a relief. I'm going to stop right there. You know what I mean when I say offensive? If a person doing a woman impression acts like this, okay? I respect your identity, whatever you want to identify as. You know what I mean? You know, respect that I have, you know, a choice. A choice. Because I'm not barging into the, the rallies demanding all of those you better stop calling mine perhaps i shouldn't care so much about an optional additional costume but the thing is i don't care so much i think it's very stupid i'm not going to lose any sleep over it if anything it's a relief those female hormones must have kicked in at the end what's it called blasting out that wannabe womb kool-aid jammers <sighs> the estrogen man ah oh god is that, write that down. No. Write it down with your boobs. No. That's me. That's too far. The estrogen man, like the Kool-Aid man, bursting through the imaginary womb? Yes. That's too far. That's too far. You're lucky there's no animators.